All right. We are not on an adventure, but yeah. we're on a taste adventure. Ooh. <laughs> so we have, what, six different types of drinks from around the world. This is in the spirit of our favorite place to go, Club Cool. Yeah. So if you've never been there before, it's at Disney World, Epcot, and you taste all the different Cokes from around the world, and they're like Coke products. So Fanta, they have Mezzo Mix, which was there for a while. If anybody ever has Kinley, that's my favorite. Yeah. They don't have it there anymore, so yeah. that's really disappointing. So we were feeling homesick for Club Cool. And so we decided to do a taste test of some new drinks. Great. Oh yeah, we have to come up with a rating system. Yeah. Okay. Taste. Yeah. Smell. Okay. Appearance. Yeah. And fizz factor. All right. Fizz factor I'm gonna take to the enjoyment. Basically. Yeah. Okay, I get you. So. One to five? One to five, All yeah. Right, cool. So, so go down meso mix first. Can design. Yeah, can One design. One out of five. I would say three. That's what I was going to say. Yeah. I think it's fine. It doesn't make me want to. No, it's not super cool. We mostly bought it because we knew it. And it's orange soda and I like orange. It, or orange flavor. And it's not weird looking enough that I would yeah. put it back. <laughs> no. But I see this. Look at this. Whip. I see that and I think I'm getting gypped. Really? Yeah. I think it's a classy can of soda. Okay. Well, we disagree on that one then. Okay. Oh, we forgot to shout out to my mom for these glasses that we're using. They are uh, like an old McDonald's series. By the way, fast food chains, your shit used to be a lot better for Happy Meals and whatnot. Like, this I'm sure was a Happy Meal thing. And look how amazing this is. <laughs> I don't think this is it. I bet this is like buy five burgers, get a glass. Oh, that could be. Because the Arby's have yeah. glass too. Both Betsy and I, one thing we bonded over is that our families <laughs> drank fancy holiday dinner uh, with Arby's sparkling glasses. apple cider with Arby's glasses. Yeah. We'll put a picture of those in here. Too. Yeah. Okay. So I'm just going to pour a little bit. Cool. So you can get the taste. Okay. Smell. Smells like soda. It smells like soda, yeah. Like Coke, yeah. regular. Really? Oh. But we have a different reaction here. I think this just tastes so sweet. Uh huh. And like, ugh, not good. See, I like I will, it. I will give you the rest of it. All right. Now, another qualification, we usually drink Diet Coke, so some of the sugary ones won't, will, will be more of a shock to us. Yeah, but I really, oof. Oh, I like it. I've always liked Mezzo Mix. At Club Cool, really? my, I still think Kinley Lime was my favorite, but Mezzo Mix was my second favorite. I definitely think this one, I would rate smell as like two. And taste is like one. Taste was not good. I would not drink that. I yeah. That's nuts. I'll give you that. Okay, I'll hold on to that. <laughs> my my ratings. First of all, smell I'm gonna rate as not important. <laughs> who, who you know buys a can or says, oh man, I'm a big fan of that soda because it smells so good. I think some soda smells can be good. What if it smelled really bad? Well, then that would be a turn up, but that's probably a sign of other things. <laughs> but anyways, uh, taste, I'm gonna go five out of five. I really like this. I like orange flavored soda. All right, soda number two. Soda number two. We're immune. I'm sure there is a much better way oh, to yeah, say it. Oh yeah, we're saying it wrong, I'm sure. Okay. Let's see if you can figure out how to do it. So this first off look of the bottle, is pretty cool. Yeah. I would say, I would rate it like a four. Uh huh, why? Mainly because I see this bottle, and one, I don't think there's a lot of liquid in there. Uh huh. But, and it is, it's 6.76 .6 fluid ounces, so, so a lot less yeah. soda. But it also looks like a kid's, like a kid drink. 
Really? Like a squeeze it. Yes, because I we were just talking about squeeze. Yeah. I love the look of squeeze it. I mean, maybe because they were sugary drinks when I was a kid, and I love them. So I would rank. I would put through 4.5. The 0.5 off because of the size. Yeah. Like, I still think, come on, you know, please give me some more soda. And frankly, World Market, a bit overpriced, but <laughs> whatever. So remove the seal from the top. Okay. Detach the, the plunger from the center of the cap. Place the plunger on top of the bottle. Press down firmly with the base of your palm to release the marble. Oh, there you go. Okay. So we got the plunger out. Yeah. And now we have the bottle. Yep. And we just put it in there? Yeah. Press down firmly. Oh my gosh, this the is kind of hard. The base of your palm. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I can't do it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let me try. Whoa! Whoa! 10 out of 10! 10 oh out of 10! Oh my gosh, look at that! It's like, I don't even know if you can see it. It's like fizzing and it's stuck right there. So that it's like fizzing. That is too cool. Okay. This one smells better, like by a lot. I'm already ready to really like this one. I like this one. Yeah. I would probably give it like a like a three out of five. For taste. I think see, I was gonna maybe I'm an easier grader. I was gonna say I'm not such a fan of the taste of this one, but still give it a three out of five. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it kind of it's kind of uh, medicine-y. To me. Really? See, I think this is, I like this more because it's not a safe. Really? Yeah. I, it really comes across medicine to me. For smell, I'm still calling not important. <laughs> well, I think fizz factor is where it's at. Fizz factor. This is like a five. Enjoyment with the marble. I mean, that's, that's sold it. I know, that's the coolest thing. Song. And like, what does the marble do? Yeah. That's amazing. Really, yeah. really cool. Okay. Cool. On to Spezzy. And which one was this one? This one is from Ger of Germany. Germany. It's another orange soda with cola. Ugh. I really think that this is something like a soda design that you would see with, um, like on a TV show where they have food products that aren't real food products. Like they can't do name brands. Oh, yeah. Okay. I see what you're saying. Because this is like. Really generic looking, yeah. but also looks, looks like a traditional yeah. soda can. Okay, the pour. Boy, this one's a loud, a loud pour. Ooh. So you know it's good. Ooh. See now. This one. I'm gonna change from not important to. This one smells rain. Yeah, that's not such a great smell. We have discovered something about each other's taste. This is disgusting. Oh my gosh. I don't think it's that bad. I will give you the rest of mine. That is terrible. This is like a zero, a negative five. It is so bad. I, I think it's middle of the room, honestly. That's why I put it as a three. I'm holding out for the next one. All right. Well, let me finish. <laughs> choke, 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 choke. <laughs> On to our third, no, I can't count. This is our fourth one. Yeah. And I am super excited about this one. It's called MN Doodler, right? Or so, do you think it's MN Doodle? On Doodle. On Doodle. On Doodle. On Doodle. A L M D U D L E R. But what's really cool about this is it's an herb soft drink. So it's an Alpine Herb Soft Drink. Yeah, natural Alpine. The can is the best can that we have here, in my opinion. And design. Yeah, we haven't really talked about design. Like, what is the woman wearing? wearing it must be a traditional Alpine hat. Yeah. 
with like Diana, Princess of Wales wedding dress. It's a good mixture there. Okay. Oh, please be good. Ooh, I think I'm gonna love this. I think this is gonna be my new favorite soda in the whole world. I think we, this could be a study in like bias. <laughs> I know this is good though. Yeah. I can't really smell anything. Oh yeah. That's good. That is really good. Yeah. There's this soda place in uh, the this um, what's it? What are they called? Food, the uh, food cart area near us, and they make all their own sodas. And there's one that's a basil with lime, and this tastes like that. Yes, exactly. It's so good. That's exactly what I was gonna say. Oh man, that's good. Five. I'd say four. I it's still not. My favorite. That's true. Taste. I'm I'm biased because all the other ones. Well, the spezzy was hey, so bad. Go with the five. Okay. You feel like it's a five. I think the five was. Pretty right, good. Yeah. I think it was pretty good soda. Yeah, but that was definitely the best. It was. It's very Kenley esque. Oh yeah. Kenley is still tops. But this but, yeah. is good. Yeah. Man, I would like go back and buy this. Yeah, I would actually buy that at World Market. Yeah. As a unique. Treats. Mm -hmm. I don't. So far, I wouldn't do that for no. any of the other ones. All right, our two bottles. All well, right. our last two bottles, I guess. So this is the Fentiman's Full Bodied Shandy Panache. And I'm sure. I wonder if it's Shandy Panache. And first question is it's it? It's a twist off. It's a twist off. But don't hurt your hand. Right, well, Here, are I'll you sure it. it's not a twist off? Yeah, because it says twist off. Oh, there you are. Look at that man, my woman up. Ooh, there. it's fizzing up to the top. Oh, it's peeking out. Ah. It's pooping! Ah. Whoa, that's actually good. No! <laughs> okay, fine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's some panache. Whoa, this <laughs> smells like beer. Smell it. Yeah, see, I think there might be some alcohol. No, because it says de-alcoholized beer. Oh. So it's non-alcoholic beer. Oh. <laughs> you also said that, like, de-alcoholized beer. 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 Oh. Man, this looks terrible. We'll see if this is any good. This is a classic case of, <laughs> you know, perception bias or whatever. Whatever the phrase is. We haven't gotten on the This smells smell. less like beer than... It does smell alcoholic though. Okay, here we go. That is weird. That that tastes like beer. Yeah, I feel like... Well, you, you finish here. Tastes like beer with like lemon soda. Yeah. <laughs> I think it kind of tastes like beer mixed with sparkling apple cider. Ooh, yes. That is exactly what it tastes like. Yeah. That is weird. So it's not ter it's not bad. I mean, I we drink we don't drink just be I mean for a few reasons, but mostly we just don't like the taste. So yeah. I'm not going to be a huge fan of the taste. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why if you wanted beer beer, you wouldn't just drink beer. Yeah. And if you want soda, you drink soda. Right. Like maybe yeah. this is like old timey soda. I would still put it up above Mezzo Mix and Spezzi, so really? I would give it like a three. A three. Now, Mezzo Mix and Spezzi, you did one and zero, respect <laughs> respectively. I still, I think it ties with this one, because I yeah. would probably be more likely to finish that than I would that. Really? Now, and nobody knows what I'm pointing to. to. Leche, yeah. I'd be more likely to finish this one than this one, I think. This really? is still pretty sweet. That's true. I don't know. I would put, I put it as a two. I, it's, I'm not a huge fan of the taste. I mean, the times I've had beer is oh, we're in a foreign country and it's kind of like awkward not to have it. <laughs> so if I, if that we were in that case and this was the drink presented to me, I'd be like, yes, this is great. <laughs> but in the context of my choice, uh, it's not, it's not the, it's not my choice. Okay. So. Well, there you go. Yeah. All right. All right, last one. Last one is the cold sarsaparilla. Sarsaparilla. And if you don't know what we're referencing there, it's uh, Carousel of Progress. Yep. 
what now here's I'm gonna test Betsy's knowledge something I don't know so Betsy you will have the crown of bigger Disney fan okay what scene is that what is it, does he say a cold spasparilla okay I think this is in the 1920s scene when it's hot it's and they're doing, and he has like all the electrical appliances. Okay, so that's a that's a good guess. You know? I do not know. <laughs> so I thought he knew. Should we check really fast okay, to see yeah. if you? That's right. So it's in the 1890s. The 1900s. 1900. Well, with all this talking, I worked up quite a thirst. I think I'll take one of those newfangled trolleys down to the drugstore, soda fountain, and meet the boys for a cold sarsaparilla. There we go. Yep. That was the longest anecdote ever. Well, uh, hopefully there's some editing involved <laughs> in this one. <laughs> I don't think you're going to have to see the whole research process. <laughs> okay, let's try it. I'm yeah. excited. I All think right. this one's going to be good. This smells like root beer. Yep. It smells like root beer bubble gum. Did you ever have that? Oh, I yes. I know exactly. The root beer hard candy. No, I had bubble gum. What? There was root beer bubble bubble root beer bubble gum. Well, it was uh, not that's good. A, yeah, that does not sound very good. <laughs> I didn't like the root beer hard candy. Mm -hmm. so. Oh, that's pretty good actually. <laughs> actually, think it was terrible. Oh, I disagree. I don't. Maybe I am a bigger fan of root beer than I, I think. But I actually think this is pretty good. I feel like all three of those sodas are like a hundred times too sweet. I'm on Om Doodler is my drink, my beverage. This yeah. would be my. I would rate that for taste. The our rating system has been just thrown out. Yeah. But for this one, I would rate it like a a two. A two. Yeah, I would rate it lower no. than the Shandy Panache. No, I would rate that as a solid four. Yeah, I think that's on par with the whole like, Rank them from one to six. Okay, one is Fezzy. Wait, one being the top, first place oh. or six first. <laughs> <laughs> I thought one was moving to yeah. the bottom. <laughs> In a random turn of events, yeah. so I decided that's my favorite. Yeah. Um. Okay, so I'll start with six. Yeah. Well, six is Fezzy. All right, from the bottom, yeah. Um, Fezzy. Seven is Mezzo Mix. Uh, five, silly. <laughs> <laughs> five is Mezzo Mix. All right. Four is Bickford's traditional soda. I almost said five again. <laughs> Three is the lychee yeah. Shira Kiku brand right. soda. Two is the Shandy Panache. Two, really? I, um, it's growing on me. Mm. And the top by like a land, like a galaxy. Yeah. I would rank Mesomix number one. I stand by my, like, my, uh, um, what's the word I'm searching for? Fondness <laughs> for Mesomix. Uh, but it also probably, honestly, a little bit influenced by the fact that I got it at Club Cool. Which, well, that was an awesome trip. It was. It's a, it's a yeah. it's free soda. So, one Mesomix, two Om Doodler. So, not as much of a difference between the two of us there. Yeah. I would put three, the Sarsaparilla from Bickford's, which sounds like the fake tool company in Home Improvement. Yeah, what is it called? Bentford's? Yeah, something like that. Bedford's. Well, okay. <laughs> uh, let's see, that was, that's my solid top three. Then I would probably go, um, ooh, Spezzy, probably. Spezzy. Four, Litchi, and then, or excuse me, Five Liche, and then six the Sam Shandy Panache. Mostly because I just don't like the taste of 
beer or if yeah, it's and it whatever. basically tastes like that, which yeah. is crazy. Yeah, I don't know. It's like carbonated non-alcoholic. There's some really beer. fun ones here, so definitely let us know if you tried any of these. You can get them all for like pretty cheap at uh, World Market. Not so cheap, but it's fun to try. It's really fun. So it's fun to see what it's yeah. like, and we'll see if anybody in these countries actually drinks these. Yeah, things. yeah. <laughs> Feel free to comment, though I don't know if we're reaching any of I them. highly doubt anybody yeah. uh, has yeah. done soda. Maybe we're like uh, Michael Bay movies. We're shit in America and we're big internationally. <laughs> could be, we could be yeah. the next Michael Bay. Yeah, there you go. Well, thank you guys for watching and we'll see you next time. This is delicious and it's low calorie. Oh my gosh. New, uh, servings per container, 3.3. Three servings in one can. They probably do that to hide how much sugar you're having. Yeah, because it says it's 33 calories. <laughs> so it's 99 calories. Yeah. This is pretty good though. It's too bad none of these have a top to screw on. Ha 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 ha!